Hey, Jenny. Hey, Graham. Why are we taking a look at this? Because there are some erasers that we need to drop. Yeah, or, you know, depending on the region, flick, I guess. Uh, so this is our flick erasers for the Switch. Uh, this is, believe it or not, a game we've actually been anticipating. Uh, it came out in Japan a couple years ago, but uh, the company that makes these things has been localizing games a lot and just happened to not do this one for a while. Uh, so we were kind of expecting it to, to make it over here. Um, let's check it out. This is this is not a AAA video game. Um, this is a this is a small budget kind of thing, um, but it's got a lot of charm and I, I like it. Uh, yeah, I like the Emperor and Empress there. Yeah, but yeah, so I'm just going to jump into the most default thing to, to show what's going on. This is sort of a port of a mobile game. Uh, what this company does a lot is make mobile games and then make Switch games out of them. So like, there's different stuff in this than there would be in the mobile game, uh, but it's, it has some similar lineage, I guess. Uh, but in this game, you have an eraser on a desk, as you see. This is us, and then... Uh, for you can use a touch screen on this stuff, uh, uh -huh. but to use a controller, which we're obviously doing for the purposes of this video, uh, you hold a button down, whether it's X, uh, and then you pull back and you'd flick in that direction. You can also hold Y and rotate it clockwise, uh, or A and do counterclockwise. And so what we're doing is we're trying to be the last one on this desk. If if you knock them off the desk, you win. If they knock you off the desk, you will uh, lose. If you knock yourself off the desk, you lose, regardless of whether you also knock them off the desk. Yeah. So that I'm sounds, gonna... It's pretty obvious, yeah. Yeah. And you get three lives. That means when you lose a life, do you get, like drop back on top of the desk again? Yeah. So in this single player mode, you're trying to get through as many levels as you can. So you have three lives for that. Uh, and then every five levels, you get to like a, like a milestone. So you could start at level 10 or level 15. Uh -huh. um, but I'm just going to do some basic stuff here before we get into the weirdness that makes this game kind of cool. Uh, but even this is entertaining if you ever mm -hmm. made up games while you were at school. Uh, this is for yeah. certain, that kind of thing. This definitely has some English in it. Uh, it I don't know if, if they actually got someone who's a native speaker to do it. Um, uh -huh. Probably not, but... Uh, that's fine. Oh, uh-uh. Ooh. Hoisted. <laughs> I, when you get to later versions of this thing, you'd be like, okay, I need to knock them off. No, what you need to do is get them to think they can knock you off and mess <laughs> them up. Do a lot of obstacles come up, like in later levels, as things get more difficult? For sure, yeah. I wanted to show some of the basic stuff here, but uh, that's definitely the case. Right now, I'm going to yeah. try some trickery. Yeah! That <laughs> um, has kind of a pool quality. It'd be like, okay, I want to hit this thing from this angle. Uh, as you uh -huh. see, it's, it starts to get pretty weird. Um, it's got this, you know, this clear pencil here. Yep, there we go. Ooh. That's how you do it. Yeah. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's boss time. The shoe. Oh, jeez. It's an eraser, though. To be clear, everything is an eraser, <laughs> um, including the shoe. And the physics, for what they are, uh, they're pretty consistent in that. Uh, they're things that are not erasers, right? Like the pencils. The erasers right. kind of stick. And like that shoe has that fiery aura to it, too. Also, uh, the developer of this game is Satbox, which you might know uh, from every single object in the game having their name on it. Well, at least I got nearer to the center here. It's a big shoe, and I, I'm using the like default. Like this is the this is the Andy of this game. There we go. It's a tiny eraser. It's not particularly useful. I might get knocked out here. Um, but the idea is you keep playing, you keep unlocking more erasers. Uh, uh, okay, okay, okay. I might have this. Oh no, I, I just missed that opportunity completely. I'm pretty sure we're getting knocked off. Yep. Ah. Oh. All is lost. I have more lives. How dare you? <laughs> All right. Let's see if I can do this with the last life here. It's just so much heavier than this eraser. I'm, I need... No. Okay. Well, that's okay. Because uh, we made some levels and we got some points. 
right. Um, and what do you do with those points? Well, let's go back and check it out. Uh, so just before we get any further, there's challenge, which is kind of like tough battle mode. Um, this is a whole thing. We'll get to it. Um, uh, then multiplayer, you have battle, which is I kind of where this game shines, is if you get some friends around to play this game with you. Uh, there's some some weird party modes, and then yeah, we'll do flicky races. We'll get to that. Um, but uh, let's let's earn some more points so we can we can. Do this. So this is, I think this is probably from the mobile game. Uh, every three hours you can get points. <laughs> so you roll here. I'm gonna try. Uh, what do you think I should do here? Uh, go for mint. Can you go for double or? I mean, I don't really know how I would do that oh um because uh, i'm still aiming and doing thing you know what i'm saying like roll yeah. so that it says double on top when i'm done is very difficult to judge but i can aim uh, okay. and i can spin maybe go for one base okay all right well i'm gonna go do this then see if that works for me oh oh okay hey, you got the double uh it's it looks like it's giving me a triple there. I don't really know how that happened um, because I'm pretty sure I was halfway between two different ones, but it's fine. Uh, we got some points. So let's go to the mysterious classroom. <laughs> this thing has a gotcha mechanic for no reason. <laughs> so let's do it. Um, so you just pick one of these desks and then there's an eraser in it. And that's just how you, uh, like, that's one of the ways you unlock erasers. Okay. This is a bat. Apparently, just says he 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 he. Mm -hmm. Sure. Okay. Where should we? What desk should we try next? Uh, do the upper left. Okay. Okay. It's pretty steady. Box. <laughs> um. But yeah. So you unlock things that way, right? Uh. And so let's let's go back in here. Uh, and let's, uh, let's go to challenge. First challenge. Let's not. You know. Okay, we gotta knock over the pencil. Okay. Oh. Feels like a, my hand needs to be steady. Yeah. You did that, yeah. We did it. So that's like the default, like, hey, here's the thing, right? Um, but just let's, okay. <laughs> let's, <laughs> we'll go 11. That seems fun. So this game just does whatever the heck it wants to do with its like weird physics engine and objects. Uh -huh. So how about basically Pachinko? Yeah, that's really cool. You want that? You could. Um, so I'm gonna put some spin on this little ball eraser. See what happens. Oh. <laughs> Could be worse. Yeah, 30 is not bad. Okay. We're gonna. Okay. I mean, I know I, I know I need more than that, but let's, let's see where I get. Oh. oh. I'm so I'm so sorry. Also, it says good luck, which is a transliteration. Uh, here, uh, localization is important, uh -huh. and we love calling out good localization. Uh, mm -hmm. But this is the absence of it, and mm -hmm. it says good luck when you don't do well. So we're gonna retry this because I, I okay. think I can I think I can do it. I believe in myself. Yeah, I think and you can do it. We're just gonna see what. Putting no spin on it and launching it does. Still 30. You need you need a 50 to do this, clearly. Right? Like, that's... Right. That's just how it goes. Oh! 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 oh. Come on. I wonder if I launch it before it falls. <sighs> you know? I'm not having good luck. We're gonna do one more try before okay. I give up. And then I'm gonna give up because it won't happen. Oh. This is, this feels 
Like it's really just trying to mess with you. I don't even know. Oh! Oh! At least didn't go into the 20, too. Okay. Okay, we're done. We're done. <laughs> we're done. Um, but there's just, there's just little, basically little toys to play with in here. Um, uh -huh. but what if you could try to unify Japan <laughs> with erasers? That seems like something, quite a thing. Yeah, uh, I think they just thought no one would stop them if they tried to do this. Mm -hmm. So you got this kid, times were troubled within the school. You know, racer flicking spread far and wide. Mm -hmm. So you gotta conquer Japan. What do these two things have to do with each other? Nothing. So I, I have made a character here, um, mm -hmm. which is just your name and your uh, <laughs> your hometown, which you get to mm -hmm. choose where you want to start. Um, but yeah, so you just try to conquer Japan. So um, we're gonna we're gonna do this. So let's move down to Aomori. Uh, I would not recommend if you ever get this game starting up here because you the first thing you have to do is beat Little Apple, which is an apple card eraser, and it's good. Um, <laughs> it's just a good eraser. But I think I figured out a good strat to beat it, which is this fish, which is an eraser. Don't worry about it. Yeah. Um, this fish is actually not very great, but uh -huh. I find that people trip over the fish a lot. Uh, <laughs> also, the fish has decent leverage. You, you wouldn't think, but it does work. Okay. Oh. I'm just amused ah. how much it looks like a fish. It's just, I mean, it doesn't have to be an eraser, you know? Like, they just gave it eraser physics, so they didn't have to make <laughs> it look like an eraser. It does look like a fish. And I'm pretty sure there are many fish in this game. That's my sense. This is a particular fish that just happened to get randomly through the gacha. Um, but it's, I like it a lot. And there. Yep. Okay. Okay. Ooh, there. Yeah. Th this is basically like battle bots with erasers. <laughs> like if you just, oh, I'm the wedge. I got under it. Now I can, you know, run it into the spikes or whatever. It's that. Yeah. It's turn-based that. Also, that that's one of those pins that has a bunch of different colors in it. That's just a, that's, that's a fun thing. That's really for just like a little racer game. Yeah. Yes, it is. We beat Little Apple. Uh, I don't want to tell you how many times it took me to beat Little Apple the first time I played this. Mm -hmm. But a lot. Then you move on to like this bowl. Um, huh? Favorite subject, math. I don't know. I don't know mm -hmm. if that's going to turn out well. For this scene, but yeah, you get to stages like this where it's like there's a glue stick to like yeah. connected to the table. All right, let's see if I can. And like a little football. Yep, it's a little football. Oh. <laughs> yep, that was was a good job by the <laughs> opponent. Uh, I had nothing to do with my failure. I would think that the bowl here would really kind of be at its best if it gets flipped over. Uh huh. Yep, no, now I win. <laughs> Bye. Okay, let's see if I can make this. That was a nice one. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> That's the thing about that bowl. I would never choose to use that bowl. It's bad. <laughs> um, but yeah, so you do that kind of stuff in this game. It's, it's weird to be like, yeah, this is cool. I like it. But you know what? I It's cool and I like it. Um... But they, so they're they're like weird. Um, I I gotta show you Flick Eraser because you okay. know the the game that you've seen so far. Right. Yes. This has nothing to do with it. So this has got anthropomorphic um, erasers that have personalities, um, and you know uh, why not, right? Yeah. Um, I'm actually a pretty big fan of Tracty, uh -huh. the Protractor. Um, I just, I just like the character. It has a good design. I mean, you know, it's a protractor. Legs. Um, but, uh, this, this is a game where you move and jump around. Were you expecting this in the game? Because it's no, here. No, not. Um, <laughs> so, there, 
this is a fun like multiplayer thing where you're trying to get the most points because there are coins and there are negative coins and you get a bonus for getting there fast. Um, you also have like dash attacks. Okay. But yeah, I like uh, Tracti's shape. Oh no! Oh no! Ah! Oh, oh negative coins! I don't want negative coins! Oh, can I just jump? Yeah, I can. Okay. Oh. Uh, okay. Well, it's fine. Uh, I got the potion that made me big because it's a video game. Uh, there we go. Okay. All the glue sticks. All the glue sticks. Uh, oh look, you remember those? Remember those yeah, characters? Oh, they're playing Drop Eraser. I hadn't seen that before. That's fun. <laughs> That's fun. They are flicking themselves around during this race. Uh, so they exist in the same world. This is not like a fantasy. Uh, all of this is the same place. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Come on. Oh. 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 How did I do? Time up. How did I do? That's not bad. That's not bad. No, that was but, uh, you know, there's like a multiplayer mode where you like jump around and just oh I can use Eric eraser as an eraser I don't know if I want to do that Eric eraser has sentience why would I <laughs> um, but so there's I it's just silly and fun and also we have ignored this up until now we're not going to Ooh. do that anymore we are going to also I should note that this since the term based stuff you can just use one controller or pass around the system and play it that way um, I have tried to make some stuff, but I, I would like your your help here. Sure. Okay. Uh, so we got pieces. Um, uh -huh. Now, where should we start? So we got these like small erasers. We got uh -huh. like a heavier eraser. We got like a round eraser. We got some pencils. We got some two-sided pencils. We got some, I think, pin caps. Um, we got some some thin plastic rulers and measures of various kinds, and we have like some stuff we, where should we start that one thing is retractor right yeah how about we start with that okay and so we got that uh now this is we can rotate it uh -huh. um so what, what, what are we trying to make here what do you think uh well i think that'd make a good base on it and there's kind of something that'd be kind of a little heavy and weighted so that way if you used it it would keep from falling off the table also just made the, the like the grid is even but the size of the retractor is odd yeah no that's a thing uh but the good news is as long as uh -huh. we keep building one to the left then the the thing itself would be fine oh okay um, you know like okay, if, if yeah. like the small eraser is two but the big eraser is three so we could we could do that yes, we have right to use the big one yeah we have to um, use the big one then so we'll do that uh Hmm. Actually, let's, let's let's make some space, right? Nope. Okay. Uh, what else have we added to this thing? Have you used the pen cap yet? And like, if you have, how does that end up working, like in practice? I haven't used it on my own stuff, but I huh? I've seen it on things. I've used it on the built-in erasers, and like they seem good if you want to like push at a spot. I would put one of those on. Okay. Put it up there. Um, yeah. And for good measure, what if we put, oh, oh we can expand. Oh, hey. Good. Huh. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, we have to have two of those then. Oh, yeah, for sure. Oh, come on. We're professionals at something. Um, so then we made this over to the right. That's our that's our new thing. Uh huh. Let's let's give it a test drive. Yeah, of course. Kind of reminds me of like the Kingdom Heart gummy ship thing. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Um, so you know, it's got a bunch of different spots we can pay in game currency to get more spots. Why not? Um, we can kind of use them in like any mode. Which is pretty strange. These these specialized challenges are a little different, um, uh -huh. but uh, so yeah. So I, I let's we'll use our new one, but I do want to take a look at like the kinds of things you get here. So they're they're normal racers, right? There's the kind of stuff uh -huh. that could get built. Um, there is uh, special racers that are I guess they're racers. This is a macaron, mm -hmm. you know. Um, this is a guitar. It's very important. 
The key um, tower is very good. There's deluxe erasers, and those are weird. Ooh. Let me see if I can show you some of the ones I have. Do do. There's like that. There's Eric is here. <laughs> um, there's these from the game. This is just so good. It's actually kind of difficult to use yourself, but it's difficult to fight. Um, yeah. Uh, but yeah, and then there's custom stuff. So let's go in with our custom eraser and see what we can do. And let's start at stage five um, so that we can see if we can do this this time. Okay. Okay. So I think our probably our best approach is to maybe get a, a center spot here and also just get this ruler off of us. It's a real problem. Yeah, okay. that's, a, that's a good point, yeah. Okay, let's let's see how this works for us. Full speed ahead. Haha. <laughs> -ha. Being the bigger eraser generally helps here, but yeah, okay, let's let's so. see if we can spin with this piece. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Okay. I don't hate this design. <laughs> okay. Let's see how far we can get. Okay. We have so many bells and whistles that they don't have. <laughs> I find that it doesn't really matter, but let's... Well, okay. Ooh, that was close. Yeah, this is not really where I want to be in terms of rotation, but let's let's go anyway. Let's just do this. Oh! Ha-ha! <laughs> it's very cheap. Simple music, but it's yeah. good. I it's enjoy it. Huh? It's good for for this game. It's better than some music I've heard in like other more official games. So this is the most official game. <laughs> it's an official Satbox game. <laughs> it's very Satbox, very official. Ooh. This is a good. I was not expecting this to be so good. It's pretty good. This this is the this game of erasers. <laughs> <laughs> Get out. That's really weird. Yeah, I mean, you know, there's there's ambition to it for sure. <laughs> uh uh. We got a starship. Ugh. What are we gonna do? Oh, uh, that was probably well, not a great decision. We kinda look like a starship too. Uh Yeah. Ooh. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. Uh oh. Okay, can we beat this truck? truck? The compass is a problem. Yeah. Oh. I see how it's gonna be. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! <laughs> Get out of here. Yeah. I have not gotten up to five lives before. This is a good one. <laughs> Like maybe this one was trying to be like a bug. Maybe. Yeah. I like that we have the two different directions because, like, we got the one that's got a lot of force, and then we got the one that's like got a little more leverage, maybe. Yeah. Oh, it's glue stick. It's gonna huh. be the death of me. The physics seem really good in this. They're like simple, but like also you learn them in a, in a fun way. Mm -hmm. Ugh. Okay. Oof. But it's okay. We get to the next boss, then that'll that'll, that'll be it. It's a good look at this game. Ugh. Also, if I lose five lives to this thing right now, <sighs> it's not great positioning. Well, not awful positioning. Let me let me see what I can do. Because if we yeah, turn this spin way, around. Then yeah. oh, no, I didn't quite do it. Yep. Yeah. Oh, I don't like the computer laughing at me. Not nice. This guy does have not have a good design. This is yeah. It's very heavy is the problem. We don't we don't have a yeah. lot of counters for that with this thing. 
right? Like the fish, at least if it were big, you'd be like, well, sure, trip over me and fall. <laughs> um, we don't have a, really a way to trip. Ah. Oh. That was a little really more close. air there. Okay, let's let's see if we can. Yeah. <laughs> Hell's yeah. Okay, that's what English speakers say, for sure. Okay. I feel like we're just gonna push this one off. Don't need a lot of finesse for this, I don't believe. But it doesn't mean you can't use finesse. Oh, that is what it means. Oh. <laughs> you sh <laughs> should not use finesse. Okay, but at least we, the things are out of the way now. Maybe I can... Uh... Yeah. I did like how it had that little shot of ours just on the ground there. Yeah, it's good. Oh, no. Okay. It's, it's now or never. Yeah. You can do this. Oh! Well, with that, get some, get some points. You know? It's good. Yeah. It's good. But yeah, I don't know. This game is just, it's quirky, and it's not that expensive, and it's got a bunch of multiplayer stuff. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna get in here and sh show the sort of stuff it's got, right? Because, like, uh -huh. battle stages, if you wanted to do, then you have, uh, okay. I guess I do have to come up with stuff. Um, got a bunch of different battle stages right like there's the default stuff but then it gets into like kind of complicated things here <laughs> um there's a bunch of battle arenas that are cool um and there's also like a whole list of party challenges that's really that cool, cool. Do, do, do. for example curling this is actually it's it's tricky um, because you see the point values there. You're trying to get in like the 50, but failing that, you don't want anywhere near it. Yeah. And then you're like, oh, it's curling, and then you forget that these are erasers uh, and have the physics of erasers, so that you really have to not, you know. <laughs> I'm just kind of showing what it is, but yeah. Um, they're just little challenges in here. Um, and yeah, there's a lot of stuff. Yeah, there's, there's so much to um, this. There's co-op stuff. There's weird bonus stuff. Was um, there bowling too? It's a lot. This thing is like flicking footballs into goals. It's they if it can be built in the engine, they just did it. Um, <laughs> and they didn't care whether it made any sense, and it doesn't. But yeah, that's this game. It's it's just weird, and we wanted to check it out. So, thanks for joining me, Jenny. Thanks.